The Duke Blue Devils are taking on the Miami Hurricanes, and it's going down in the ACC this Monday, February the 6th. My name's Allie Burns from Picks and Parlays, and before we get to that free pick, I got to let you know about my official sponsor. It's Caesars Sportsbook, and for all new accounts, all you got to do, wager 10 bucks all the way up to 1250 bucks. No worries, because it's a risk-free first bet. That means win or lose, the money gets dropped back into your account, along with 1,000 reward credits and 1,000 tier credits. All you got to do is download that Caesars app and use my promo code Woodful. Get yourself hooked up with Caesars. Now with me today, I've got expert NBA. I don't know about college basketball though. I don't know how smart you are about college basketball. We're talking Duke and Miami here, and I know what you're going to pick. Duke, Miami, Canes minus three, totals 145 and a half. Tim Earl, I don't even want to hear it. Go ahead. Tell me why you think you can beat the Blue Devils by three points. Uh, 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 um, no comp. No, I'm kidding. Um, Duke, I, I don't know if, if people are living under a rock or something is going on. Saturday night, they beat UNC. Uh, probably a bit, probably their biggest win, barring any big March Madness run for them this year at home. Just a, a crazy. I watched the game. I'm a UNC guy. I watched the game. It was, it was, I, I it was heartbreaking. But, anyways, Duke won that game and. It's a, it's a big letdown spot. Miami 12 and 0 at home this year. They've just been one of the most solid teams there. They're 18 and 5. They're ranked. Duke possibly could be ranked soon. Um, I know the AP polls come out tomorrow. So by the time the, the AP polls come out, this could be two ranked teams going at it. But this is just a humongous letdown spot, in my opinion, for Duke. I'm going to go ahead and take Miami minus the three. I am sorry, Allie. Okay, facts being told, I agree with you. Miami has often in the past had Duke's number, and I agree. This is a huge letdown spot. I actually liked the Tar Heels in that game getting the points. This was like John Shire's time to either like fail or succeed, you know, and luckily he succeeded there. So great, but so much effort goes into beating the Tar Heels in that game and covering a spread. I agree. I would roll with the Hurricanes here, solid home team. And if you look in past ACC uh, games, Miami usually has Duke's number. So I can't even disagree with you, you little brat. Um, but I think you've got the right play here. So we're taking the Miami Hurricanes minus three. Tim Earl, are you still number one in the NBA? Yes, and uh, I, I kind of widened my legal lead a little bit. I know it, I got a little bit short for a little while. I know I was like yeah. up about half a unit or somebody. Uh, I'm up like six or seven now. So uh, a little bit of a solid run in the NBA lately. Um, and college basketball was really solid for uh, for Saturday as well. Really good day. Ready to keep rolling with it. Excellent. I had a good Saturday too. All right, people. So if you want Tim Earls. Premium plays his best bets. Look for Earl Sports Bets over at picksandparlays.net. Remember, numero uno in the NBA. Use our promo code LVII. It's going to save you 20% off whatever you get from picksandparlays.net. Until then, let's freaking go, Hurricanes, when they play Duke on Monday.